Hi you guys, um, welcome to your uh, seven day midsection meltdown. Um, so for seven days we're going to be just working on our core and our abs, so right around this section, our midsection where many of us have that trouble zone. So everything, all of the workouts are focused there. Um, I just want to cover eating, drinking and all of those things, but first off, like I say, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Um, maybe this is your first challenge with us. Maybe it's not. But overall, I hope you enjoy the next seven days. Um, so just touching down with food, okay? So obviously the food we eat plays a huge role in well, our belly, our bloat, and our abdominals. Um, so if we eat carb heavy foods and carbs are not the demon before people go into meltdown but if we eat a carb heavy diet we're going to be bloated the same with fizzy drinks um, and sugary treats we're going to have belly bloat that's going to make us look bigger than what we are so for the next seven days i want you to think about your food so protein which is essential okay for keeping you full longer for fat loss and for repair after all of these um, workouts. So think about protein in your diet with every meal. So that's meat, eggs, uh, yogurt, um, fish, uh, dairy, some vegetables and uh, beans and pulses. So trying to get those in. Um, breakfast would be better if you had proteins rather than cereals and toast. Um, plenty of fresh fruit and vegetables, um, so lots and lots of night, I mean you can have frozen as well, but plenty of vegetables and fruit. And we're going to be drinking around about two litres of water each day. So the water will help flush us out, it will help us stay hydrated and it does help with our metabolism and obviously fat burning and better sleep, better skin, better, just better overall health. Um, on a morning, I want you to have a hot water with some lemon in. So that just aids your digestion and it just gets things moving. And again, it will help with that belly bloat. So some lemons, hot water, first thing on a morning when you wake up, plenty of water throughout the day. Ditch the sugary diet drinks. It's only seven days, okay? It's only seven days. That's what I say to everyone. And when we do our 21 day shred, at the very beginning, everybody seems like 21 days is such a long time, but it flies and this will fly as well. Um, so if you're a bit unsure as to what you should be eating and drinking, maybe nutrition is a minefield for you, and I know it is for many. Um, attached in day one, I do have our seven day real results plan. Um, so this is an amazing plan, it works. It works really well. We normally have around about seven to, we've had up to 13 pounds weight loss in the first week on this diet um, or this nutrition plan, I'll say. So it's all calculated out for you. I would say at around about the 1400 to 1600 calories. So there's lots of different calorie options in there, but that is the one I would go for. So 14 to 1600 calories. Um, the recipes and everything are in there. The shopping list and everything is in there. Maybe Maybe you want to mix that up with something of your own, um, but it does work and it is free. Okay, so use the guide, regain at the checkout and it will come through for free and that's yours to keep. So you can go back to it. I do have members that go back, you know, when they've got a wedding or something on, they shoot back and they do those seven days again. Um, so it's an absolute fabulous plan. It does involve some meal prep and it does involve some cooking. Okay, so if you're time dependent or you've not got a lot of time, um, maybe you just want to kind of freestyle it, but we have got this group. Okay, so please feel free to ask, but just think about reducing those starchy carbohydrates, those sugary drinks, those cereals, breads, white pastas, white rices. We can have, have all grains. Um, moving on to sleep. So I know some of you have got children, which makes sleep quite hard, but try to get around about six hours of sleep a night if you can. Okay, because again, sleep wreaks havoc with our hormones. And again, that is where we store all of this fat around our middle. Okay, so that is diet covered, okay? And I will be sharing diet tips and recipes in the group, okay? Moving on to exercise. So we've got seven days of exercise. Um, each workout is a hit style workout, so every workout will be 30 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. Um, so just an interval timer on your phone, a stopwatch or something like that to follow along. Uh, the video is in your challenge and every day the video will go into the group as well, the YouTube link, so you can head off over there. They are private videos, so they will only be unlocked 
for people um, that are on this plan. So don't go um, giving them out because they are private videos. Um, the workouts are all pretty simple. So you need, do need some equipment, but if you haven't got it, don't worry, because I know it's like getting hold of gold bulletins these days. So I use a dumbbell. I use a kettlebell. I use a stability ball, so a gym ball. But again, don't worry if you haven't got any of these. And sliders. So some of you might not have seen these before. Okay, so I use sliders, gliders, whatever you call them. Um, they're about $1.99 normally, but I wouldn't hazard a guess at what they are now. Um, but if you don't have any of these things, don't worry, because you can always modify it out with um, bodyweight exercises. And I do demo some non-equipment exercises as well. Um, it, day five, six, and seven is no equipment. So if you're stuck for an exercise, have a nausea on there um, or ping in the group and I will give you an alternative. So make sure you do your workout every day and check in. So I take you through one set and then, which is around about seven minutes, preferably if you can do two to three sets, maybe it's on a good day you do three, but try and get two sets in. So a 15 minute workout every day. If you really pushed for time, Maybe do seven minutes on the morning and go back and do the seven minutes on the night. So anything is better than nothing. But if you combine your exercise with your diet and you follow both steps, you will obviously get results. But if you just do one or the other or you don't do them properly, so you do it half-hearted, then the results won't be um, as good. So that said, there's the um, ins and outs of it all. Welcome. Look forward to seven days. Be active. Share anything. Share your recipes. Share your questions. Um, enjoy the workouts. Don't worry if you think you might struggle on any of them. Yeah, it's roasting here and I was uh, sweating today trying to record them. But just enjoy it and good luck and look forward to the next seven days.